Hi everyone, it's James in Japan. It is Wednesday, January 15th, 2020, Reiwa 2. I'm off to Starbucks for some coffee, and I think today's video is about traffic signs and their meanings. And I might talk a little bit about the point system for traffic violations. If you come to Japan with an international driver's license, you can only drive in Japan for one year from the date of your landing permit or one year of the date of issue of the international driver's license, whichever is first. If you're planning to live in Japan for more than 12 months and drive in Japan, you need to switch over to a Japanese driver's license. You must change your driver's license status. We are approaching a maximum speed sign indicated by that circle. Japanese speed signs are round and white with a red rim around the edge and a blue number. Dashes on the road allow you to change lanes. However, if you see a long solid line like this, you cannot cross over. If a cop sees you, you're getting a fine. I'm about to cross through this crosswalk, but if there are pedestrians on the other side, I'm required by law to wait for them to cross, no matter how slow they walk. If you break that rule, you're getting a ticket. This is a main road. It's fatter, so the maximum speed here is 50 kilometers per hour. I'm going to turn right, and you can see the long, solid white lines on the road. I have to stay in this lane. No switching over. To my left, a no parking sign. The blue sign above is a school crossing sign. Drivers are required to stop if they see school children wanting to cross. Failure to do so is a fine. To my right is an elementary school. An upside down triangle painted in red is a stop sign. The writing on the road is tomare, which means to stop. A sign with a bicycle in it means you can cycle here. Do you see that thick white paint on the road? That means you make a full stop here. Then you can proceed with caution. Up ahead there's a speed sign, but the trees are blocking it. You see? Let's talk about points. Japan uses a point system. You are given points for various offenses. Once you have accumulated a number of points, your license will be suspended or revoked. 6 to 14 points. Suspension for 1 to 6 months. 15 to 24 points. Revocation for 1 year. 25 to 34 points. Revocation for 2 years. 35 to 44 points, revocation for 3 years. 44 points plus, revocation for 5 years. This is for drivers who haven't had their license suspended in the last 3 years. Well, that's it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a good day. Bye.